Hi friends, I'm Shumon and you are watching ASA Technical. Today I am going to show you how to fix grub error, no search partition, error, unknown file system. Maybe sometimes you are facing such a problem on your dual boot computers and laptops. Like error, no search partition, entering rescue mode, grab rescue. We have made a video before for regarding this problem, but some users said that INS mode normal command is not working and again it shows error, no search partition. This error will appear if you forcefully delete Ubuntu or Linux partition from your laptop or computer's disk. Well, don't worry about it. Here's the best solution for this grab error problem. Well, let's get started. At first, type here ls, then hit enter. Then you will see the partition of your computer's disk. Then you have to find which one is the Ubuntu partition. To know that, you have to check each partition. Well, let's check the partition number one. Just type 2 checking ls bracket start hd0 comma ms dos 1 bracket close. Then hit enter. In the same procedure, check other partitions to find which one is the original partition where the OS is installed. Even after checking all the partitions shows file system is unknown. Then type here set then hit enter. Then you will find the original partition where the OS was installed. Alright now I am just going to type set boot equals to first bracket start hd0 comma ms dos 7 bracket close. Then hit enter. Next type set prefix equals to bracket start hd0 comma ms dos 7 bracket close slash boot slash grab then hit enter next type ins mode normal then hit enter well as you can see again it shows error no such partition well don't worry about it here's the final method to fix this problem you need an original windows installation media it can be windows 10 8 or 7 and just follow the instruction exactly at first insert the original windows installation cd dvd or usb flash drive and just restart your computer to restart press and hold the control and alt keys on the keyboard and then press the delete key and be ready to enter your pc's bios Alright, go to boot menu and select inserted windows installation CD, DVD or USB flash drive and boot from that as you can see. Then click on next. And then click on repair your computer. Alright, click on troubleshoot option. Next click on command prompt. Now type the command this part and then hit enter. Next type the command list disk and then hit enter. Next type the command select disk 0 and then hit enter.
Now we have to type list partition and hit enter. Then you have to select which one is original primary partition where the operating system was installed. Next I am going to type select partition 1 and hit enter. Next type the command active and hit enter. Next type the command exit and then press enter. Now you have to rebuild boot configuration data. Just follow the instruction exactly. Just type the command bootrec space forward slash fix mbr then press enter. Next type the command bootrec space forward slash fix boot then press enter. Next type the command bootrec space forward slash scanos then press enter. As you can see, maybe you will see total identified windows installation 0. Don't worry, just ignore it. Well, next type the command bootrec space forward slash rebuild bct. Then hit enter. Alright, type the final command exit and hit enter. And then click on continue and be ready to remove the windows installation CD, DVD or USB flash drive. Alright, now as you can see the computer's boot is fixed from windows bootloader. Yeah, as you can see Windows 10 and Windows 7 both OS working properly. We hope you will like, of course let us know your opinion. If you have any questions then please let us know. Please like, comment and share, we need your support. And guys, please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you, thanks for watching, have a nice day.